Hello, dear friends. Welcome back to the channel. Today, I've got something super exciting lined up for you. We're going to take some everyday items, things we often just throw away, and turn them into something incredible. We're making a DIY plasma gun using a soda bottle and a few small items you probably already have around the house. This project is not only fun, but it's also a great way to get creative, recycle, and learn a bit about how plasma works. So let's jump right in and get started. The first thing you'll need is a soda bottle. This is going to be the main body of our plasma gun. The cool thing about using a plastic bottle is that it's lightweight and easy to handle, making it perfect for this kind of project. Plus, it's something most of us have lying around. Next, we'll gather some simple components. Wires, a battery, and a few electronic parts that are easy to find. Don't worry, I'll guide you step by step, so even if you're new to DIY electronics, you'll be able to follow along. The goal here is to create a small electrical circuit that generates plasma. Plasma is an ionized gas, and it gives off light, which is what creates that awesome spark effect you'll see when the project is done. <laughs> To start, we're going to connect the wiring to the soda bottle. The wires will help conduct electricity to the tip of the gun, where the plasma will form. Now when you're handling the wires, be careful. Make sure they're securely connected so the current flows properly. It's important to take your time here, especially if it's your first time working with wires. A solid connection will make sure everything works safely and smoothly. Now we're going to connect our power source. For this, I recommend using a small battery pack. Batteries are great for DIY projects like this because they're portable and easy to use. Make sure you choose a battery with the correct voltage to generate enough power for the plasma to form, but not too much that it becomes unsafe. If you're unsure about the voltage, feel free to drop a question in the comments and I'll help you out. Once we have everything wired up and the power source in place, it's time to test the plasma gun. When you turn it on, watch closely as the electricity forms a visible spark at the tip of the gun. This is the plasma. It might seem like magic, but really, it's just the science of electricity ionizing the air and creating plasma. This glowing, electrifying spark is what makes the plasma gun look so awesome. And it's also a great demonstration of how electricity works. But remember, Safety is super important here. Plasma is powerful, so make sure to keep a safe distance and avoid touching the tip while the plasma gun is active. If you're planning to show this to younger kids, make sure they understand how to use it safely. It's a fun project, but safety always comes first. And there you have it, your very own DIY plasma gun made from things you'd normally throw in the trash. This project is not only fun and creative, but it's also a great way to learn something new about electricity and plasma. I hope you enjoyed building it as much as I did. If you found this video helpful or inspiring, go ahead and smash that like button and don't forget to subscribe to the channel. I'm always coming up with new, exciting DIY projects that you don't want to miss. Plus, if you have any ideas for future projects or questions about this build, leave them in the comments. I love hearing your thoughts and interacting with all of you. Thank you so much for watching and for being part of this creative community. Stay curious, keep building, and I'll see you in the next video. Take care and have a great day.